Baylats Coral World Underwater Observatory is a public aquarium, park and conservation center located in Eilat, Israel. It is the biggest public aquarium in Israel, and it hosts over 800 species. It was founded in 1974 and was the first of its kind. The park and aquarium is located to the south of Eilat's Coral Beach Nature Reserve. History The park was founded in 1974 by the zoologist and marine biologist David Friedman. Also the idea of the observatory was planned in 1972, it took careful planning to create the observatory without harming the natural environment. The observatory was built completely on land, which was then flooded with water from the Red Sea using armory parts and other metals. The base of the observatory was connected to large iron chains, and after the observatory was placed many corals were planted on and around the observatory in order to repair the damage that was done during the making of the observatory. The coral reef around the observatory flourished and became a major feeding spot for many fish and other marine wildlife, both carnivorous and herbivore. Exhibits Entrance aquarium The entrance aquarium is a medium cubic aquarium in the entrance square of the park. It features several species such as corals, butterfly fishes, crabs, and more. The aquarium, as well as in all the other exhibits at the park, is connected directly to Red Sea, and so the water is pumped and replaced constantly with Red Sea water, and so fully natural conditions are kept within the aquarium. Topic: Red Sea Circular Exhibit. The Red Sea Circular Exhibit is a 360 degrees exhibit in which the visitors stand in the middle and are surrounded by 360,000 liters of water featuring a complete natural ecosystem. The exhibit features corals, herbivore fish, carnivorous fish, parasites, crabs, shrimps and more, all living in one functioning ecosystem. All the animals are fed daily thus ensuring they don't harm each other. The circular exhibit is used for research about the unique ecosystem of coral reefs. The water in the circular exhibit are pumped from 42 meters deep in the Red Sea and are circulated 24-7. <laughs> Turtle and stingray pools The turtle and stingray pools are three shallow meter deep pools, which exhibit hawksbill sea turtle, green sea turtles, and spotted eagle rays. In the middle of one of the pools there's a small sand island for female turtles to lay their eggs on. When the eggs hatch, the baby sea turtles are taken into a small aquarium, where they are safe from predators and where they get food and vaccinations. When they grow they are transferred to bigger aquarium, and finally when they are two year old with very high chance to survive in the wild they are released into the ocean. The Underwater Observatory's Turtle Conservation Program is one of the leading programs in the field and so far has released hundreds of turtles back to nature. <laughs> Rare fish exhibit The rare fish exhibit is a large exhibit separated into three rooms which exhibits rare fauna and flora of the Red Sea in medium-sized aquariums. The first two rooms feature animals such as lionfishes, Red Sea clownfish, starfish, rare corals, moray eels, lobsters, seahorses and more. In the exhibit there is a total of 250 species, featured in 35 medium aquariums. Some of the animals in the exhibit are endemic to the Red Sea, and are in the observatory park for means of breeding and conservation. 
The Seahorse Conservation Program is a success, and since 2002 thousands of seahorses has been released into the Red Sea. Despite the animals the aquariums are designed to mimic the animals' natural habitat and thus educate visitors about different marine biomes and habitats. The third room of the exhibit is the Nocturnal Room. The nocturnal room features various nocturnal animals such as flashlight fish, squids, jellyfishes, crabs and more. The exhibit also features active and awake corals, as corals are nocturnal animals. Most of the animals in the exhibit are capable of bioluminescence. <laughs> Amazon hut. The Amazon Hut is a rainforest theme exhibit featuring both aquatic and land based wildlife from South America, such as caimans, electric eels, piranhas, arowanas, dart frogs, lizards, tarantulas, and more. It is used to explain fresh water ecosystems and the importance of rainforests. Shark World The Shark World exhibit is a huge exhibit containing 3 million L US gal of water, and featuring 20 shark species, rays, and corals. The exhibit has a huge viewing window, an underwater tunnel, and an interactive explanations area with educational stations about the importance of sharks and the threats that make sharks endangered. The Underwater Observatory Coral 2000 Additional attractions and activities Oceanarium The Oceanarium is a 4D movie documenting the life of sharks in the wild, and in particular, the rare whale shark. Opening pearl oysters Feeding pool Topic Amusement Park Topic Additional Shops In addition to the animal exhibits, educational stations and daily activities, the park hosts several shops including two for jewelry, one for photography, a diving shop and a gift shop. There are also three food kiosks, a coffee house and a ''Shark Bay'' restaurant on site. <laughs> External links Official website Media related to Underwater Observatory, ALAT at Wikimedia Commons Media related to Underwater Observatory Marine Park at Wikimedia Commons ALAT Marine Park on Zooinstitutes.com